Hey there everyone, this is Piper here, and this is a live 1 versus, uh, it's actually a 2 versus 2 31k battle. So I'm playing with a player called Sandy Star, and I've actually played this player before in the past. I know he's very good at CWB, but I've never actually played 30, 31k with him before. And I actually joined this battle. And I don't know any of these two players. I've actually played uh, Vias before in the past, actually. And looking at it, I've played him before in the past, uh, Zara 4. But again, I haven't played him at 31k before. And I think they're they're, they're okay players. So what happened was um, they both joined up with the same team. And Sandy Star was Carthage. And Carthage, in comparison to Armenia and Parthia at 31k, is fairly strong. So I said to um, Sandy Star, um, I'm going to sort of even up a little bit. I'm going to choose Scythia. And Scythia's got fairly bad infantry for 31k. But you do get the, the chosen archer. I've gone with six head hurlers as well. Eh, no, six uh, head hunting maidens. I actually had a unit of dogs in the, the marshy area over here uh, in case um, Armenia or Parthia brought horse archers put them on that side the idea is to let them tie right a little bit and then put the dogs in but they appear to be moving on the left side so what I will do is I will come over here and help out on this side I don't know whether I'm not actually played with I brought one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I brought ten chosen archers. Um, Sandy Star, he's gone uh, Carthage, but he's actually brought six cavalry, sacred band cavalry. They're gold, gold with looks like two chefs there. Enemy is gone with two cataphract archers for Armenia. Uh, one Persian archer, a lot of cataphracts. Uh, so obviously these players know the benefits of cataphracts, and they brought um, six, looks like six, six uh, Armenian heavy spearmen. What we will do is we will push. Obviously my headhunter maidens are good against cataphracts, but we don't actually have enough to defeat. Parthia and uh, Armenia. We want to keep our cavalry fairly, fairly close together. So it's quite an interesting battle for 31k. I think what I will do is I will. Now I'm getting the. I do have a range advantage over. Uh, Parthia. We're gonna stay here and get some shots in against the. We're gonna put our dogs on the the left side here. Still are the the Persian, uh, the Persian horse archers and the the Kata archers. Okay, we're getting some good shots in the backs of the cataphracts there. We actually asked the archers to attack or uh, the cataphracts came in to attack there. So we're getting a lot of good shots in against the cataphracts. Pushing for an attack here. Got the cavalry battle happening here. Hey, 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 
and we're gonna send in the head hunting maiden uh, the head hunting maidens. So the combination of the Cafrax being surrounded by the phalanx and my army gave them a, de uh, a morale decrease, they got outflanked. You have killed the enemy general. That's now pretty much game over now, to be honest. Now they may turn and run. Attack, um, I can't attack. really see him coming, them coming back from this now. We get Parthia coming in on this side here. Put the dogs up here as well. Our infantry here as well. Try and get some shots in with the archers first. We've got our dogs there. We'll switch the... I don't know whether to switch to flame or not. So I think we'll keep the flame on actually, because these cavalry are about to attack. And let these guys retreat a little bit. And then we'll fire in the headhunting maidens. back and we'll take out the cataphracts. Good Carthage coming back here to help out. Uh, still got the archers in flame. All the archers are attacking, firing against guys over get our get our archers close to the phalanx and that'll help them out Cataphracts. So what we need to do now is we're going to take our cavalry out of wedge and when you have cavalry in wedge they actually run slower so we don't need to we don't need that powerful piercing formation anymore. But all we need to do now is we need to just chase down the enemy. We keep the archers on flame and push forward to so take out this clump here. Charge in. Oh, we use the archers for a bit, I think. The warlord of the enemy army That's the enemy just like the That's Parthia meant to defeat there. Hunt him. So Dogs it's just Armenia left. Eating. Of flames to get kills. And that was a really interesting battle actually. Um I've played uh, with Sanistar in the past, and I've played uh, Vius and I think it's One Tag his name uh, in the past as well, and they're fairly fairly competent players. Haven't played them in this kind of battle environment before though, like 31k. But they're. Uh, they're experienced players. So that was a that was an interesting battle. Hopefully Armenia admits defeat run. soon attack, and we can check attack. out the the battle uh, kills at the end. But again you don't often see uh, uh, Scythia, Parthia 
and Armenia played uh, 31k on large scale. We're just gonna, I don't think Seb one tag's gonna admit defeat. So to get this battle over with, we're going to chase down uh, the enemy. And there might actually be dogs still. I had dogs there. That's uh, VSA just left the game there. He didn't actually admit defeat. So we're gonna chase down. Oh, it was actually, sorry, it was actually I tag, or one tag that didn't admit defeat. This is so that's a, a that's a battle over, that was a great game. Um, music to everyone played, that was a interesting battle, everyone played well. Uh, we'll check out the, the kills next. I had 878 kills, Sandy Star 1,500 kills, uh, Sevens are one tag, 300 kills, and Vias, I think it's called, 666 kills. So that was really well played to Sandy Star. A lot of kills there. Um, he had the double double amount of kills I had, and he had more kills. Uh, a lot, about the same as the both players combined. Uh, Carthage is a very good Carthage out of these factions, probably the best faction. Uh, Sacred Band, very powerful. So that was a really interesting battle. Thanks for watching. This is Piper signing off.